So the last, and definitely this is not the least, so we are, we'll discuss the activity. Oh, wow. Pas lang, activity. Activity, so this is symbolized by capital letter A. So the definition is, this is the quantity of radioactive material and not the radiation emitted by the material. So when, uh, if you can still remember our discussion of half-life, so we were talking about radioactivity. Diba? The emission uh, or the quantity of radioactive material, the emission of mat uh, radioactivity of that certain material. So it is the quantity of radioactivity in which the nucleus disintegrates every one second. That is why we have the term disintegration per second or DPS. So for every one DPS, there is one Becquerel. So this, therefore, this is the SI unit. So by the way, we don't have any derivation. We don't have any formula for activity. So um, the conversion factor. The SI unit of activity is Becquerel. So take note again, 1 BQ, 1 Becquerel is 1 disintegration per second. And the traditional is Curie. And therefore, for every 1 Curie, there are 3.7 times 10 raised to 10 Becquerel. Again, natrohong ko lang pag naging samok-samok ko na kamo. So for 1 Curie, Curie, small, uh, capital letter C, small letter I. So there are 3.7 times 10 raised to 10 Becquerel. So that is, this is now our conversion factor. In other words, we can now convert the traditional into SI or SI into traditional using this conversion factor. Let's try. Let us convert number one and number two. And I hope you will uh, patiently watch the video that is played right away. Thank you very much, class. If you have concerns, clarifications, questions, or violent reaction, kasi nauuso ngayon, pa-post-post -post pa Facebook, pwede man diretsyo nalang ipakianak answer. So, <laughs> ano, you can reach me through different platforms. Okay, sige, let's play the videos. Here, convert 33 millicurie to millibecquerel. 33 millicurie. So copy millicurie as denominator. And then, okay, so anato na root unit which is Curie. So, hain da po? Mili Curie or Curie? Okay, so, Curie. For every one Curie, there are 1,000 Mili Curie. So, cancel naton, hi Mili Curie. So, convert na naton from traditional going to the SI unit. So, Curie to Becquerel. So, araman natin that for every 1 Curie, there are 3.7 times 10 raised to 10 Becquerel. Tama ba? Tama. Okay. Then, copy natin ni Becquerel and the unit that we wanted to come out. Okay. So, that will be Mili Becquerel. So, hain da ko. Becquerel or Mili Becquerel? So, mas da po si Becquerel. For every one Becquerel, there are 1,000 Mili Becquerel. Cancel na to ni Becquerel. So, adi pa. May 1,000 kita kanina, tas may 1,000 DD, may as denominator, tas may 1,000 liwat as numerator. So, cancel na lang na to. So, combine all the whole numbers and combine all the exponents. Wala namang ikukombine na na exponent kasi wala na exponent sa baba. Okay, so that will become 33 times, again, we have another whole number, 3.7 times 10 raised to 10 millibecquerel. So, 33 times 3.7, that is calculator. 
Okay, so we have 122.1. Times 10 raised to 10 millibecquerel. So express our answer into a proper scientific notation. Which means we are going to move the decimal point going to the left by 2. So maad tayo ng exponent by 2. So that will become 1.22 times 10 raised to 12 millibecquerel. Okay? Okay. So in this problem, we are to convert pen, 63 microbecquerel into millicurie. So from the SI going now to traditional unit. Ay, salamat. Katapusan na yung nga akong pag-video. So 63 microbecquerel. Copy natin as denominator. Copy as a friend. Okay, so 2 becquerel. Hi, da po. Microbecquerel or millibecquerel? Ah, no. Microbecquerel or becquerel? Excited na kasi moment. So, mas da po si becquerel. Which, for every one becquerel, there are 10 raised to 6 microbecquerel. Tama ba? Tama. Okay, so, convert natin from SI going to traditional. We know that for every one curie, there are 3.7 times 10 raised to 10 becquerel. So, cancel natin. Becquerel and becquerel. So, curie going to millicurie. Hind ako, curie or millicurie? So, mas dako si curie. That for every one curie, there are 10 raised to 3 millicurie. So, combine all the whole numbers and combine all the exponents. So, uh, 63 divided by 3.7, okay, times 10. So, we have our exponent in the numerator side, that is positive 3, plus. So, 6 plus 10, that is 16. So, from positive 16, magiging negative 16. Unit is... Millicurie. By the way, class, pasensya na ha, but do not forget to cancel the, the units. Okay, so, 63 divided by 3.7, that is 17.02 times 10. So, positive 3 plus negative 16, that is negative 13 millicurie. So, let's just make this... Um, a proper scientific notation. So, one whole number followed by decimal point. Huwag na lang, 1.7 na lang, no? para gano'n na masyado halaba. Times 10. So, since mag-move kita going to the left, so, mas maghaharani kita decimal point. Which means, iibanan natin ang aton uh, exponent in 1. So, that will become negative 12 millicurie. This is our final answer. Okay.